probably would be interested in a yellow bag because I don't have a yellow bag right now. So if this is not a mini puzzle, I think that'll be really cute. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Jess. Today I'm going to be talking about the latest Loewe collaboration with uh, a Studio Ghibli or Studio Ghibli. The last few years, Loewe have done a few really cute animations. They did My Neighbor Totoro a few years ago. Last year they did A Spirited Away. And this year, guys, they're going to be doing Howl's Moving Castle. So let's talk about some of the leaks that we've seen on Jonathan Anderson's Instagram. So if you love shopping and handbag videos, I would super appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get to like 10k subs this year, so I would love to uh, grow my channel and I'm going to keep posting videos as much as I can. I was on holiday for a few days last week and that kind of ruined my schedule, but I do have a few like little shopping vlogs coming soon and a few unboxings as well because I have been very bad at shopping ban. And I'm going to say guys, this latest, uh, these leaks are also not helping my shopping ban, I'm just going to say, but let's go through it and discuss today. So. Um, if you go to Jonathan Anderson's Instagram, firstly he posted like a little kind of uh, sky with a house moving castle in the sky. Now house moving castle for me personally is a movie I've only seen one time, so it's not doesn't really have that nostalgic feeling that I feel like it may have for other people who maybe grew up with it. Um, you know, I I have watched a few Studio Ghibli movies. I really like you know. Ponyo, Kiki's Delivery Service is really cute, Totoro, I loved Spirited Away, um, but How's Moving Castle for me personally wasn't like my absolute favourite Studio Ghibli movie to be honest, so when I heard that they were doing How's Moving Castle I was a little bit like, ah, uh, would have been cute if it was like Ponyo or something, but uh, you can't be too choosy can you? And I've heard, um, I actually read an article on Hype Beast, I think it was, that is going to be the last uh, Studio Ghibli collab that Loewe does. So I don't know that's, if that's just a rumour, but if this is the last one they're going to do, that's a little bit sad because I really was hoping that they'd do more and there'd be more like cute little animations every year. But if this is really the last collection that they're going to do with Studio Ghibli, then I think this collection is going to be very hard to get. It's going to be very limited. I know they're going to put it on the website, but I'm, I assume it's going to be in selected boutiques as well. So if you have a Loewe near you, I would, um, you know, if in your country, if they are going to have the this collection, I would um, contact your client advisor because I do think this collection is going to be very hard to get. Um, so, so far we've seen there is a little leak of this little dog called, I believe his name is Hin, and uh, this like silly kind of dog is in the House Moving Castle movie, and he features on this blue bag that seems to me, I'm not sure exactly what bag this is to be honest, it has like a little bit of a knot detail, doesn't look like a puzzle bag, but who knows, maybe this dog will appear on other bags as well. Um, this bright blue is really beautiful. Um, I just think that this character is really hilarious as well. He's like not the cutest animal, but he's pretty like humorous, his face. So that's one of them. There's also Hal in the like, when he turns into that like bird dragon thing with the feathers. This looks like it's on a canvas base with some like feathers, so I'm not sure if this is going to be on a bag because I remember last year they did this incredible uh, sh Shihiro, was it Shihiro hammock bag and it was canvas and had this like face on it. It was really epic. That was really limited and it didn't actually come to Australia, so I wonder if this is going to be on a hammock bag or something, but because of all the feathers on it, I don't, I can't imagine this on a bag, but it looks quite detailed. Uh, there's also this grandpa character it, with the, I love the blue backdrop actually, it's a beautiful shade of blue, and he has like some little flowers coming out of his beard. Um, this is also quite cute and quirky, and especially the sweet pastel colours in this design look adorable. I mean, this would be so cute on a puzzle bag, but I guess we'll have to wait and see what bag they do put this on. You've got this flame, flame character called Calcifer, um, who is like one of the main characters in Howl's Moving Castle. There's also like a girl called Sophie who is like the main character, but I haven't seen her on any of these leaks, so I don't know if there's going to be any bags with her face on it, which I think is weird because I feel like she's like the main character. But anyways, I've got the Calcifer character. And this looks like it is a puzzle bag. I don't know, guys, what do you think? I think this is a puzzle bag. 
in like the smooth uh, leather finish. Um, so it looks like it's going to be one of those more structured puzzle bags because I think like from my knowledge there's puzzle bags that have more of a slouch and then there's ones that are more smooth and box like so this looks like the more structured puzzle bag um last year i picked up the spirited away um puzzle bag and this is uh like a little bow character on it and this is more of like a grainy calf skin and it's got more slouch to it but yeah this leather looks like a different texture the actual uh, leather marquetry looks like a textured uh finish um, similar to like this character here and it's interesting because I've actually stitched around the um, edging of the flame as well whereas on this character they've just kept it pretty simple uh, so yeah that's that um, I, I assume there will be some SLGs with these characters on it as well so um, you know maybe there'll be some with the um, this layout so this is like a simple card holder Loewe sometimes does uh, this is from the Spirited Away collection um, they might even do some SLGs um, in this layout. So this is um, the No Face character from Spirited Away. Um, you know, maybe there'll be a Calcifer wallet instead. And yeah, this wallet, uh, it's, I'm currently using it, but it's really nice because they put the little stamping in here. So I assume they'll do that again for this collaboration. But yeah, I quite like this wallet. And of course, there's going to be a lot of ready-to-wear and stuff as well, but I don't know. I personally... I'm a sucker for like the little leather goods um so that's that this looks like i don't know guys this looks like an amazona just because of the lock here um this is this really um kind of fancy witch lady and she has like a fan red lipstick i mean i'm obsessed guys this piece it, it seems to me like this is going to be a little bit more of a higher price point just because when you look at the leather marquetry there's so many colors in it and it just has so much detail so Honestly, this is going to be, I can tell this is going to be one of the standout pieces, but perhaps very limited as well. Oh, and this is awesome. I've noticed that, like, in, they're including a lot of, like, diamantes and, like, crystally things within the leather marquetry. So, um, here we have, uh, this blue, is that Hal? I don't know, guys. As I said, I've only seen the movie, like, one time. So, um, he's got this little flame thing happening in the sparks. I wonder if this will be on a bag i mean i think it does look like it's on a bag i have no idea what bag uh, it has this beautiful midnight blue backdrop um maybe it will be on a bigger amazona because i remember uh, last time they did have amazonas with more like detail on them i guess we'll have to wait and see uh there's also this scare scarecrow character called Ka kakashi no kabu like he's going to be on a yellow bag so this like sunflower yellow color i personally would be interested in a yellow bag because i don't have a yellow bag right now so if this is on a mini puzzle i think that'll be really cute however i don't think i love the scarecrow character as much as like the dog or the calcifer because i don't know the, the scarecrow is kind of just like not as cute to be honest but anyway oh we've got the hin dog as well on the brown leather so this might be i have no idea guys it could be on a it could be on a hammock bag it could be on a anything really I'm excited to see what characters they're gonna put on which bag um here we've got like a it looks like a print and then an earring stuck to it this to me looks like it could be a t-shirt or a dress or something uh with like a bead kind of uh to look like an earring um and then that's all the sneak peeks i could see from that now if we go to loewe's instagram is a few leaks here as well we've got like um looks like this could be a hoodie to be honest with calcifer embroidered on it and then it has a patch here i don't know just by like the way the material is it looks like some sort of jersey uh we've got the same leak that was on jonathan anderson's oh okay we've got another calcifer character but this is a blue colorway i mean this could be on a puzzle i mean who knows guys we really don't know what this could be on but um i really like the blue calcifer actually more than the, the orange calcifer uh, just because I think those shades of blue look beautiful together and I like how they've done like a piece of leather in the middle that's like a gradient that's uh that looks really good and then the same hin dog again so um I'm anticipating more leaks to be coming I guess we'll just have to wait and see but let me know guys are you tempted to buy anything from this collection because 
Oh guys, yeah, I still have to show you the other things I've bought on my holiday, but I feel like I should be on shopping ban, but I know this is going to be so limited, and um, if this is going to be the last Studio Ghibli collection they do, I mean, I might be kicking myself if I don't get anything, but yeah, I don't know, maybe I'll just get an SLG or something, guys, like, we'll see. So, um, yeah, let me know uh, what you think the characters will be on, what bags they're going to... Um, put out in this collection and I'll talk to you on my next one. Bye!